I'm glad I got this military haircut yesterday because it was hot today. It was really hot. I started off in San Jose about 8 o'clock this morning, got out on the road. It quickly got pretty warm, especially once I hit the Central Valley. And so when I'm riding the bike, I've got this heavy jacket, I've got gloves, I've got this helmet, and it's just hot. And when I stopped for lunch in Reading, it was 106, 106 in Reading parked in the sun because there was no parking in the shade when I went to go get something to eat and peeled off my hot gloves, hot, sweaty, sticky jacket, went to a nice air-conditioned restaurant. That was nice. But uh, now I'm in Wolf Creek, Oregon, and my traveling for the day is finished. I made it about 450 miles today, and this is about 25 miles north of Grants Pass, Oregon. And I'm in a campground, and I was concerned, being this is a Saturday, that this place might be full. By the way, I'm swatting at flies and mosquitoes. But this place is almost totally empty. There were two or three cars in this whole place out of maybe 75 sites. So pretty empty out here, which is fine with me, but it's pretty unmaintained. This, uh, this terrain here is covered with leaves and I just discovered to my dismay that poison oak is here. I can't seem to get away from this plague of poison oak. It's everywhere I go. I discovered it maybe an hour after I was here. It grows differently than in San Jose. It's in these little tiny patches, not in these big clusters, and they're just sort of spread out. So I have no idea if I've already traipsed through it because it's sort of scattered randomly in this uh, this little campsite that I'm in. Oh well, I'll uh, I'll be paranoid for the next week now about touching my boots or anything, but that's all right. It'll be fine. So uh, anyway, I can't really complain much. It was hot, but otherwise the the traveling was smooth. Not a whole lot of traffic except for the Bay Area. Once I got out of the Bay Area, Highway Five was smooth cruising, and uh, made it up all the way here. And now that it's afternoon, maybe about five thirty, six o'clock. Weather's cooled down. It's maybe in the low 80s. Very manageable temperature. And uh, I have this nice quiet site all to myself. can relax and kind of recuperate from a long ride. It is a little bit tiring. I did have one thing pestering me the whole time. Not the whole time, but several times. And that was my itchy nose. I kept wanting to scratch my nose, but I can't really do it because I'm wearing my helmet. And uh, so I would just concentrate on something else and what do you know the itch just kind of went away and then I'd remember it again a half an hour later anyway tomorrow I'm moving on my goal is to make it to Larrabee State Park in Washington near Bellingham which is maybe 80 miles north of Seattle just a little south of the Canadian border so that way tomorrow not tomorrow but the, n the following morning I'll be able to get to the border in the morning, get that out of the way, and be on my way into British Columbia. But um, we have about 450 miles or so to go to get there to Bellingham, and I'm looking forward to that ride. So far, so good. On track.